into the B site as they will get their second plant of this half. Oh, no, they won't. Or not. No, they won't. Neck is with oh, a triple my kill. Goodness. Phelps, no. too, think. Shifts over to the corner. Is Phelps prepared for it? Oh, my lord, missed the shot. Fala, galera. Quem vos fala é Leandro do Retake BR. Seu novo portal de notícias de Counter Strike. Além de notícias, aqui você também encontra os melhores tutoriais para o jogo, incluindo bindes performance e FPS e configurações de volume e microfone. Perde tempo não, acessa aí, retakebr.com.br. Salva nos favoritos. Definitely feeling confident. He kind of basically said, he's like, I come into this feeling like everybody else sucks. Which is a, which is a great mindset that, to that's, have. You have to have that mindset to a certain degree. I mean, he says that there's obviously going to be respect as well in the opposition, but you always got to feel like you're going to be the best one stepping into the server on that day. Nice shot from Skulls. That's the second kill. A third one provided as the smoke plumes. And all of a sudden, this pistol round seems out of reach unless this P250 can sing. Tough angle to hit the head of Skulls, though. Zevi oh. reacts fast enough as Phelps comes down the ladder. And it's oh, all over. Pistol round Response. for and it's going to be tough. Even if you get Zevi, I don't think you'll expect Skulls to be there. And here's the first player. Zevi's got oh, another man. two kills. Double kill on the entrance, and Skulls is still waiting. He's got another. And How? Fluxo have not been... There's the spot. Easy kill. History, the last one remaining. Feels wrong to kill history. You, Just, can't, you can't kill history. You can't, it's got to live on. Uh, that's a flawless round yet again. You mentioned we have not seen them gain any semblance of site control yet. I know Plant, they're struggling with the early duels. And this could be a good way to start the round as Biguzera getting a little overzealous in mid, pushing out a little bit further. Great way to alleviate some of the pressure they've experienced these first four rounds. Gives yourself a five on four early. Now it's about can, uh, can Woody get past this AWP? If he makes a play, gives up a kill to an AWP, Zavi's going to go hunting. A little bit of a deeper angle. Will make it tough if he misses a shot. He's going to cover Hardzow's push. Okay. He's hope. He's patient. They'll sacrifice. And now it's up to Pain Gaming to try to get their way back in. They spotted one over towards Jungle. That's history. VSM is in sandwich. And the shots will come from Skulls, who has been lights out thus far as well. There's the oh, play. Oh, no oh. way that works. Sebi leaping around in connector. The bomb's still ticking away. Time is on their side. Skulls now in a one-on-one -on -one with just nine HP. Phelps knows where he's at. The nade is on the money. He going for the swing. Seven health now. And it's going to be Skulls who comes away, but the time is already too far gone. And those are the guys that are going to try and be the tip of the spears. The first one out, and they're so softened up. As long as nobody gets caught with their pants down, this should be nice and easy for Payne to handle it. There goes one of them. VSM is up next. Phelps finds one, but there's still a player boosted in the site. Nice, easy kill for Big Uzera. He's got support from Bench as well. There's no way they expected this. And it's down to just two. Now, Lukalzi does find a kill over in Connector, but it's History who's stuck on this B site, as that's where the bomb is down. Now, they can hear the footsteps of a player who is running around in window. He's going to make the cat jump. Hardzow has to spot this player over in the corner. He's still stuck in apps. He's so low on HP. He's waiting for a play to come through from his teammate on cat. As he makes his way towards the pillar, there's the flash to come out that'll gain him a little bit of access on towards the balcony. The first swing, and now it's up to history. Five HP and a one-on-one -on -one against Skulls. An expensive They just round want to finally Payne. find that round that gets him over the hump and breaks this money. And for Payne, you're just looking for a clean victory at some point so you can settle things down. That's a difficult loss early. We saw the impact Phelps was able to have in the previous round, and he's taken down right away. Oof. Nekis is there as well. This could potentially be that clean round we were waiting for, but there's history to make it cost a little bit more money. Nekis does slide out a little bit. That Skull's using the smoke and connector, and it'll all fall onto VSM. 76 HP coming up from ramp. Has a flash, and yeah, you can see that bomb way far away. Yeah, this is exactly what Payne was looking for, a clean round. As long as VSM doesn't get, like, two kills in this round, uh, they're going to be very, uh, very It means pleased. nothing anymore because mm -hmm. they've actually kind of cleared mid and felt safe there and transitioned more players over to the A bomb site. So Hardzow and Nekas to control mid and underpass with this push. Nekas was there playing anti-flash, too. Times the peak well as he's got some support from window as well. That's a nice kill coming on to Big Uzera with the op from ramp. They spot one crossing towards Tetris. And that player will be one of the two that remains as it's the op on ramp. 
And Woody, who's in sandwich. History's trying to do whatever he can with off. And it's some nice shots coming out as well. You're getting two AKs and upgraded deagles. Like three players are half bought, two players fully invested in because you realize even in rounds where you have a lower percentage of winning, you absolutely have to do some damage. So they have to bring these AKs and elements of danger into each round. Now, Big Uzera falls. He seems to be the one player that's uh, catching stray bullets pretty consistently, whereas everyone else seeming to wear impenetrable armor. I mean, you've got Zevian Skulls, who now just finds his second death yeah, that's in that's half. that's a good punish from VSM because that's a little bit of that overconfidence coming in mm -hmm. from Skulls, who's just been on fire this whole time. And now you have it from Hard Zhao as well, full committed swing, a great chance here for Flux. So they have to take advantage of this, but the deep deep angle with the AWP, not going to see the bomb picked up, but ne neck is. How much does he want to swing off this plant? There's the flashbang. History completely blinded, and VSM is inside the site. He was last seen over at top stairs, top ramp, but now they know. Do they realize he's managed to scoop up an AK? It's the double swing coming in. He almost steps into the molly. He's down to just 12 health. There's the flash coming around the corner. Not prepared for the swing that comes out. He's strong on. Yeah. I mean, that's the map they 16 2'd Paketa. That's the map they 16 10, Paketa. I believe, against Complexity. That's how they got to this point, was off the back of some impressive new performances. But hold here the we phone. Go. We've got a round potentially brewing here for Fluxo as they finally cracked into the B site. As they will get. Their second plant of this half. Oh, no, they won't. Or not. No, they won't. Neck is with oh, a triple kill. Oh, my goodness. Oh, he steps around the Molotov, but he's got a 1v1 to deal with, and he's going to retreat back over towards Marketer. Maybe that's just what he wanted Phelps no. to think. Shifts over to the corner. Is Phelps prepared for it? Oh, my Lord. Missed the shot. Everything goes right for Payne. It seems like things are going to end pretty quickly, but as I say that, Woody with the duelies claps back onto Hardzow. He's in a good position to at least farm, but never mind. The flashbang comes in, and he gets quickly taken care of. There's a player in market who's <laughs> struggling to find a shot. Eventually does get one, but it's site control lost, and it will be pain gaming going for the plan. I, look at all these fights. They're just challenging. Like, it's, it's crazy. Skulls has no fear whatsoever. Moving in. Oh, he's got another one. Now he's in a tough spot. You bit off a little more than you could. Okay, no, you didn't. No, you didn't. You've gushed the last two as well. Oh, my Lord. They did not bite off more than they could chew. They're handling business. It's 14 to 1. There's 17 HP on VSM. He's got no kit. Oh, he does have a kid, excuse me. So he's got something going for him. But P2K, very low HP. They're playing this one smart. There's the Jiggle Peak. Yeah, I mean, this is, I mean, even in the 2v1 when you're up 14 to 1, you expect someone to just, like, swing. Yeah, someone just go to just nuts. go take just that like, fight. Okay. Even close have not been close by other match standards. Here's the fast play in towards the B site, and he has no chance. He can't see a thing. Lukalzi with the Deagle over towards Pillar does at least get one, but the kills are piling up. Nekis is on catwalk, dropping VSM. Phelps gets the trade back with the MP9. The last two remaining players trying to scramble something together. And it's now down just to one. Yeah, it ain't going to happen. Scout is going to get the kill on Zevi. Now they know his position. Picks up the AK-47. 1v2. No kit this time confirmed, but that boost up from Skulls is going to just be impossible to deal with. 16 to 1, and that seemed inevitable with the way Payne was playing. And then is fighting tomorrow evening for that, that single, that lone legend spot for the America's teams. Okay, VSM. Oh, he's gonna push right into it. Oh, oh he thought about no clearing, it doesn't go deep enough. And now ramp room is wide open. Two players down secret as well. Zevi again having impact. There's a two-man stack here though, and they've got them both. That's Hord Zhao and Big Uzera hitting the deck. And now the other three players of Pain Gaming have a decision to make. And Lukowski is actually pushed into lobby, so he's got a flank play potentially coming in, but they do manage to get that bomb planted in the upper site. It'll be a three-on-three -three retake. And there is not a kit currently in possession of the CT side. And look at Skulls. If Skulls can get there quick enough, the timing might just work. But his team has fallen apart. It's now on to just him, and he's been impressive. The HP right now is the biggest problem. Headshots definitely going to be an issue. Lukowski tries to stick it, but again, it's going to be a full <laughs> defuse. Oh There's the shots coming out already. History just nestled into cubby waiting for the push to come through the doors are popped open decon swings the double doors are open as well it's vsm finding both players oh. but there's big uzera stepping up huge with hard Zhao to bring things down to a two on two now this is manageable due to the fact that the clock has ticked down so low and it feels like it's the round going on the board here for flux so hard Zhao says you know what i'm just gonna go it's for heavy it. on 10 for pain You say a new energy, I prefer a new start. 
favorite license plate of all time. New start. Yeah, a new start. Not an Arrested Development fan. I am. I, I didn't. I didn't catch that reference. I'm not oh. gonna lie to you. They don't. They don't pronounce it that way on the show. I've watched Arrested Development quite a bit. Yeah. They say it a little bit differently. Okay. <laughs> the spelling is not exactly there. To, sure. Yeah. No. Either way, we'll see how the action develops. It's actually a back and forth volley of kills that puts it at an even three on three. Zavi's Pain. Here. They've gotten access to the, the A site, so they'll get a plan out of this one. But VSM is in a great spot to potentially get a backstab coming through from HUD. It's all down to timing. Yeah, well, he's got a great one because Skull's missed it. But, I mean, you still got to contend with Hard Zhao, who's not missing a whole lot. And that AK is going to be an immediate decapitation. Now history chimes in inside the smoke, loses track. Zevi finally loses a fight. But how do you get in if you're Phelps? You got Skulls holding one angle, and even if you get past him, even if you find that kill, which you do, you got to deal with Hard Zhao. You, you knew early who was in Hut, but he could have moved around. A tap on the bomb, there's no kit, so he's got to find it quick, and Hard Zhao's just playing with him. He knows he's got every single advantage, oh, and now he's gosh. got a headshot, and spray down the body, shame him. Seven to one. Absolutely dirty. Hard Zhao was the one that prevents the flank, ends up winning in the 1v1 as well. Long flank. Oh, man. Now the spam's coming through from Woody. This is so sick because Fluxo, this is a huge gap in the defense. Fluxo has no idea. And, and Biggie Zara can choose whether to go heaven or ramp room. He's going to go heaven. Spots one. Nice easy kill. Woody again out in the open. Dropped. That's rough. Phelps 2 taking significant damage. VSM is coming on the backside of the play. It's a nice kill onto Skulls. And Biggie Zara is low, 10 HP. So there is a world we're going for this one. It's possible. Obviously, with the score being what it is, you really just got to start putting rounds on the board, and that's why you see them not even considering a save, which we would have seen maybe a few rounds prior. It's a great angle from the top of Hutt. He sees the backpack, and the last player is coming through. It's going to be VSM on site. Big Uzera, the last play player standing. 10 HP playing ring around the Rosie. That's a big clutch coming in from VSM. But just like the round prior, a very expensive round to win. Yeah, well, I mean, look, again, you'll take it. Whatever you can get at this point for Fluxo. So they're closing the gap just a little bit. Unfortunately, they just Last cannot get Last played this passively. They had that opening, that one-for-one -one trade in ramp room, which was the player that likely would have covered outside. So they can be a lot more confident that the wrap is not exposed quite yet. That's big. Just on the edge of that smoke. And another one as well. That's two kills coming in from Woody. As Big Uzera and Neck is both taken care of pretty easily. Now what do you do if you're Pain? You've got three players left standing, but you've really done nothing so far. Yeah. No map control whatsoever. Well, now it's almost like this is where Nuke sometimes gets really tough. It's like, where can you even find a pick? And apparently it's outside with the MAC-10, which makes no sense, but he's going to swap out to the AK-47. Lukowski caught out in the open. Oh, does Skulls get this timing? I thought for a second he could. You had Woody on the other side. Yeah. Instead, it's going to be the pick onto Phelps. And now things are starting to get a little bit awkward. There's the nice up shot. The Molly's going to flush him out. Skulls finds another one. Does he wait for the player in vents? There's still one currently up in heaven. That'll be the first to strike, and Woody times it well. Good teamwork. And another opening kill. That's outside through smoke as well. A little bit fortunate with their spams. Nekas is here in footsteps as they fall back. History is drop down vents and oh neck is fights against two can't even get one neither can zevi all of a sudden fluxo's woken up and come alive in this game hardza has found two and has an off in his hands an interesting peak coming in from phelps as that will be the equalizer yeah bombs all the way back towards t-spawn though so i mean ooh, uh -oh. hold on hold everyone's on. getting a little antsy could potentially be the play for woody He's out already. They have no idea. He might have an isolated fight on the first. Oh, man. Bang. He actually just pulls off a second too early. Okay. Nekas, he's kind of stuck fighting to death. And that death came quick and fast, thankfully for him. Now, Pain need to adjust and rotate downstairs. Big Uzeris here. Phelps speedily taking control of the windows. And now I think Pain is on the back foot. And this pistol round might go against them. We talked about that Should confidence building that they've been doing in the last couple of rounds. And you can see it playing out here. Fast play towards ramp room works out nicely. Neck is perhaps peeking a little bit too wide. Big Uzer was not able to get anything done as they pushed into this lower site. They also lost Skulls, which is a big part of this. Big Uzer, though, does strike finally with the P2K taking down Phelps. And finally, it took a map and a quarter of a map 
for Fluxo to show up in the series. Yeah. But they've done it. Lukowski dropping on the mini roof. Zevi's up on top of the box. Oh, oh, awkward jump, awkward. awkward timing, but he does manage it pretty well. One more coming through. That's an AK. Phelps delivering. Phelps has got a pep in his step these days. I thought he was going to drop off for a second. Instead, he's going to catch one from beneath. That's VSM. A nice nade will put him down low. A finishing blow from Big Uzera onto Woody. It's now down to a one-on-two where both players are ridiculously low. He's heard the shots coming through. Big Uzera is 55 HP. Phelps is playing ring around the Rosie, and we've seen this work out well for Payne in the past, and now will be no different. Oh, Big Phelps. Uzera has repositioned to a great spot as they make their way out onto the site. The call's gonna be made. That's the first one going down. That's also the bomb being dropped. He'll find two before being eliminated by Phelps. Zevi's in a great spot, too, to come through and find one. Kind of snoozing. <laughs> Almost took down the bomb as well. Well, I think they know. I think they know it's only one player down here because, remember, Woody was spotted deep. They are just running out of runway. So what do they do? They try to get somebody outside. Ooh. That's a nice shot from Phelps. As he takes down Skulls over towards the air conditioner, Zevi able to get the backstab from Mini. So it will be even four on four. Here's the play coming out from Door, though. As the Molotov lands, History's going to take a bit of damage, but they can't trade because of the fact that that Molly was in position, so they had to wait for it to dissipate. That's such a cool call, though, from Fluxo. I really like that. Zevi obviously kind of over overextends to get that kill into Fels to prevent the wraparound, which is nice, but uh, Fluxo's like, okay, we know where you're at. We know you're going to go back to mini. We're going to smoke you off. We're going to put you, we're going to flash in there. We're going to put you in a really weird position. I'm surprised to see even Big Uzera challenging for this in the two on three, but they wanted to see if they could get a quick kill, and now it's going to be the save call. Now it's, it's going to be back off because there's no success. And, and with the flash, too, they knew both players were there, so yep. it would make it even that much harder. There's no point in even trying to stick around. Broken ankles for the CT currently on top of the roof. That corpse looked uh, a little bit awkward, but it will be an eighth round for Fluxo. <laughs> Think of broken ankles, the least of a problem for a corpse. <laughs> yeah, when, when you're dead. <laughs> Damage. A few players take Ooh. some bullets through those smokes, but no one dead y just yet. They're going into big garage. They're not going to secret. Nice kill from Big Uzera. Smoke just clears, and Lukowski just made it into some cover. Is Big Uzera going to be ready? Lukowski has the advantage, and he still loses out. Great round from the captain again. We keep saying his name. The remaining three from Fluxo are looking for a potential opening. You've got Nekas on a nice angle to potentially take care of the first player to come through the right side. Oh, it's a duck peek. That ends up working out nicely for Woody as he kind of catches Nekas off guard. And as a result, that lower sight is lost. Yeah, that's actually so sick. What a cool little peek that Woody just busted out on him. And look at the timing from history. He might be able to catch these players on the backside of Decon if he times this right. Oh, oh no, he's been spotted. They've called it out. Big Uzera's letting him know. That's massive. God, two a kills, flank of a flank. two kills, and the information that puts Skulls on notice. This is a crazy round for Big Uzera. What a wonderful job he's done. Now they got to exit out the door. One over in control windows. VSM's got the first, but they're going to start moving in behind him. And Zevi has the all important kill. Impossible for VSM after that. And Payne, do not let this one out of their grasp. 14 to 8, two rounds away from Paris. And the defense overall is a little bit out of position, but it's only the bomb that's made it down. Ooh, look at the position from Phelps. He's made it all the way in underneath ladder. Now, he'll be taken down over towards lockers, but what a strange round. Yeah, and I mean, the bomb's the only one that drops, and they're trying to leave some lurks in position to really exploit and, and position themselves well for the rotates, but Payne wins out on all those. Wild spray can't connect in Lukowski. This is the this is the bad part of this kind of a tactic, is he's too far away to really do anything. We did see a successful 4B1A plant win earlier today in the series for Paqueta. Cover off any of the choke points. Oh, Big Uzera. Is he going to have another big round? Yeah, he's he is. He's going to get this kill on Phelps. At least one. Phelps tried to get cute through the smoke. And but, again, it's it's a great read from the captain. Yeah, but also it, it might be a situation where because he gets that kill onto Phelps, he might be like, that was the play that that smoke wall was set up for. No one's actually shifted to the lower bomb site quite yet. So these guys have gotten down into secret without any kind of response quite yet from Payne. Molotov to make sure the rotation is going to have to be the long route. The Molotov may have misbounced though, because that'll actually allow them down ladder. It, it looks like it landed more towards the exit than the entrance. And it's Zevi who comes in quick with the kill. And they're looking for more as well. And now it's all up to history. It's actually history trying to be made for Payne Gaming as they're looking to secure their spot. 
at the final CSGO major in Paris. Nekiz gets the last kill. It will be Pain Gaming moving on. Look at the smiles. Look at the cheers. Listen to the cheers. You can hear them through the wall. That is a big boy victory for Pain. And that is the culmination of a very good start and a rise throughout 2023.